<laughs> I've got a special game for you guys. It's called System Shock 2. I don't know if you've ever heard about it, but it's a really old school game that came out, I think, in 1999. It was created by um, Ken Levine, who, if you're not familiar with who that is, he's kind of like the lead on um, the Bioshock games, which are really popular. This is the game that came out before that, and I think led up to Bioshock, but I'm not 100% sure. I don't do very well with scary games and, <laughs> and math or um, pronouncing names, so this is your first time ever watching it. If there's any math problems on here <laughs> or, or really difficult names, um, I'm just going to skip it. <laughs> okay, so set on normal. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Look at you, hacker. Uh oh. Pathetic creature of meat and bone, panting and sweating as you run through my corridors. How can you challenge a perfect, immortal machine? Uh oh. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, I skip it on accident. Oh god. Hello. Welcome to the Ramsey Center UNN Recruitment Facility. Oh, okay. Please watch your step when leaving the train. The grav shafts at the end of the hall will take you to the street level training and recruitment center. Please okay, proceed no to the grav shafts. The grav shafts. Am I leaning? Uh oh, oh my god, you can lean. <gasps> Who's that? Who are you? Hello? Hold on, I gotta make a click call. Hold on. Boop, 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 boop. <laughs> oh. Looks like there is an accident. This is part of the training. Am I supposed to clean this up? Hmm? I don't think so. Okay. <gasps> is this where I'm going? Oops. Let's change that. It's gonna get really difficult over time. Customize controls. Okay. Slide left. Slide right. So slide left, which would be. Um, A. Slide right. Bind. Okay. Now lean. Oop. Oh, bind. And then. Bind. Okay. Done. Okay. I'm here already. Scared. Life is draining from it. This is how terrifying this game is going to be. Oh my god. Step oh. into the grav shafts oh. to proceed to the street level recruitment. Which one do I take? This one? Do I go up? Oh my god, I'm going up! Hello? Hello? Why is it abandoned? This is part of the training. Hmm? Is it? Where do I go? This way? Can I run? No. Before you choose your oh. career, you'll want to learn some basic abilities. First, you should go into the basic training center. When you're done with basic training, proceed to the advanced training area. Okay. Basic training. All right. Tell me. Whoa, 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 upset him. Oh god. I'm not here. I'm not here. All right. I think I'm good. Okay, all right. Whoa. What's to pick up some basic skills you'll need to get by in the service, enter this Cyberlink booth. Inside, you'll learn the basic skills you'll need to get started. Okay. Tell me what I need to do. Welcome, trainee. Oh. While you're in our virtual training courses, we provide you with a simulated cyber interface. This training interface is identical to an actual military-grade cyber interface. Oh my gosh, no way. Now, let's try it out. I'm in the army. Move the mouse. See how it changes where you look? No That way. means you're in shoot mode. Woo! Hit the tab key. This puts you in use mode, where you can use your mouse to interact with items in the world. Like this one here? Open What's your it? primary MFD, oh, or right. multifunction display, how do I do that? by clicking on the MFD button near the bottom of the screen. Okay. 
<gasps> this display shows your strengths in various areas. I'm not very when strong. When ready to continue, press the tab key to go back to shoot mode. I need to lift more. Try changing more between cardio. modes until you get the hang of it. I should probably Follow the red do path something. along the ground to the next training station. Looks like I need to lift more, cardio, and do some yoga. I'm not sure what this one means. I don't know. Okay. Take it far! To pick up Woo. items, center them on your screen and right click. This Ooh. will automatically place that item into your inventory. It's in my inventory. View your inventory, press the t To use items like buttons in computers, center them in your view and click the right mouse button. All usable items will have brackets around them. Highlight the button on the pillar and right click. This will activate the lift. No way. Try it out. If you can still see your inventory display, it means you're in use mode. Hit tab to return to shoot mode. What's up there? Is there anything up here? Hey, you forgot to take me with! What the heck? Maybe we should bring it back down, just in case someone needs to use it. Okay, I'm standing on it. Okay, here we go. Okay, maybe not. Alright, let's keep going. What's this? The object before you is a med hypo. Pick it up and then press tab to go into use mode. Right clicking on the med okay, hypo will it. use it and restore some needed hit points. Your hit points are displayed by a bar in the lower oh left corner gosh. of your screen. What up? Many objects in your inventory. See the crate in front of you? Yeah. To search it, center it on your screen and right Done. click. If you are in use mode, simply move the pointer to the crate and right click. Whoa. To take an item from that container, simply left click on it. This will automatically place that item in your inventory. To close the container window and return shoot mode, press the tab. What's happened? Okay. Oops. Okay. Use to apply. Please insert. One of the most chemical. important tools you have as a soldier is your PDA. Hey, got this it. This device stores audio logs, emails, and other useful information. I will use later before I die. Your screen to bring up the P now it's time to learn about jumping and mantling. To Oops. jump, simply press the space bar. I think I probably missed some, some really important information. Some surfaces can be mantled onto by holding to climb a ladder. Simply walk into it and look upward. Yeah, You'll look into it. You'll automatically start climbing the <laughs> ladder. Oh, whoops. I get this. Okay, there's no backup. Okay. Oh, it didn't work. Okay, I guess I'm done. Exit! You've done well. Thank you. Remember, if you're unclear on any aspect of what you've just learned, you can repeat the training. Let's go to if weapons you've training. basic training. Woo! Alright, wannabe. Doing data right there. You on board. Now we'll teach you how to handle a firearm. Give me Pick the gun. Pick up the pistol and the clip from the table. You the can equip the uh, weapon in one of two ways. Okay, Bring tell me. Bring up your inventory. And drag the pistol inventory. to your weapons equip slot near the right hand side of your inventory. Got it. If that's too slow for you, you can use the hotkeys on the keyboard. Press 2. If the You're pistol right. was in your inventory, You're it down. will equip for you automatically. You're dead, oh. To lock and load the ammo clip, hit the R key or hit the reload button on the lower right corner of your screen. I got it. Once you've loaded the firearm, Oops. take a shot at the dummy robot by pressing your left mouse button some items need to be charged with energy before Whoa. they can be used you serious pick up the laser pistol uh -huh. now use the recharging station nearby the recharge station will juice up all of your energy based items weapons batteries you name it. look at it is it fully charged is it answer the question game <laughs> I have set this done. <laughs> okay. Freeze! I'm a cop. Weapons are not fine wines. They do not get better with age. The colored dot on the lower right corner of the screen tells you what kind of shape your firearm is in. Green is good, red is bad. To fight the effects of wear and tear, Oops. a soldier with maintenance skill can use a Oops. maintenance tool to improve the condition of his weapon. Okay. Just pick up the tool. Uh -huh. Open your inventory and drag yep. the tool onto your pistol. Okay. Remember that maintenance tools are only good for a single use. Oh no. Oh no, they didn't. Oh no, they didn't. No. Guess what I got? I got my pistol. <laughs> okay. Let's 
drag it. Slide it. To the exit. I gotta keep the gun? Now Dang you're it. ready for the Marines. Take a look at the other Where training areas first before you enlist. They might just come in handy. Nope. Pretty sure weapons is all I need. What's that? UNN Recruitment Center? Here's where you make your choice, soldier. Nope. Here's where you enlist in one of the three. Inside, we'll teach you the base. Welcome. You'll notice when you're in the Cyberlink booth, we'll mm -hmm. provide you with a temporary cyber interface and the skills you need to accomplish the training tasks. No way. But they'll only last so long as you're in the booth. Okay. The object in front of you is a container of nanites. Nanites are consumed whenever you perform technical tasks, such okay. as hacking or repairing. Or cyber. When you pick up the container of nanites, what? they do not go in your general inventory but are instead displayed in use mode on the bottom left of your screen. Walk over to the keypad by the door and try out hacking. Use the okay. keypad by right-clicking on it. Okay. To the right of the number pad, you'll see an orange tab labeled Hack. Ooh. Let's click on the tab. Text will appear indicating the difficulty of the hack and any bonuses that apply. Click on the Start button to begin hacking. You'll see a grid of nodes. Clicking on the node will either turn it bright or dark. To successfully hack, you must connect three bright nodes in a straight line. Beware the ice nodes with the red outlines. If one of these turns dark, you fail the hack, and you might break the item you're working on or worse. You can restart your hack attempt at any time by hitting the reset button, though you'll okay. have to pay the nanite cost again. Oh no, they didn't. Okay, let's do this. It's a line, right? I got the line! Oops. Look what I got! What's this? <gasps> you can use nanites to buy items from replicators. To no use way. a replicator, right click on it. Okay. Yeah. Then left click on the Please item you wish to purchase. Selection. The item you purchased will drop into the slot below. Make sure you pick up your first before you choosing value wrap. Should probably put some chips on top of that. And some bullets. The bullets! <laughs> we got to have some chips and some pop with the bullets! <laughs> okay. That's enough of that. Alright. You learned the basics of the technical skills. There are several you learned, other technical skills. Inside, you will learn, you will learn how to we use your fingers. You with a virtual interface. The red bar at the lower left of your screen tells you how many side points you have. Side points symbolize the current ability to use your side powers. Psi hypos replenish your side points. Okay. Try using a psi hypo and watch your side points increase. Oh. When you've reached your maximum in side points, move to the next station. Mm. It's going up. I'm full of Psy. Kingdom style. Hey, sexy lady. This Psy amp amplifies your Psy powers and lets you project them into the real world. Whoa. To equip it, Whoa. pick it up and then hit the tilde key. Firing the Psy amp activates your currently selected Psy discipline. You currently have access to two disciplines cryokinesis and kinetic redirection. Go into use mode and click on the arrows on the bottom right of the screen. This will cycle through your available side disciplines. Later, clicking on the arrows above the number to the left will allow you to select side disciplines from higher tiers. Use cryokinesis to destroy okay. the robot and kinetic redirection to pull that nanite container towards you. Be careful. Holding down the mouse button can augment the power, but holding it down for too long will cause burnout, yeah, which will damage you. Okay, you're done. If you run out of psi right. points, use another psi hypo. <gasps> she came back! Come to me! I got you. I got it! If I right click, you had you. Hey, hey, guess what? Come in to me. Come to me. You don't want to move, do you? Fine, stay there. Be that way. Mastery of the mind is a slow but rewarding process. 
Return you have no idea how difficult that is more guidance. Before you enlist in the OSA, it would be useful to experiment in the other training Navy, courses. Marines, OSA. What does OSA mean? Ashford Special Awareness? Um, oranges select apples. What is the difference? Talk to me! I don't... I want to back up. Quit making me look over. Ah, X is backwards. So what's the difference? Which one do I pick? The nerver and the nerver. And the baby. I really want to pick. Oh, well, I guess there's no option then. Here I go to serve the day in my neighbor's ship. Does not look like a ship to me, but a giant flying spaceship.